Welcome to Infinity Academy. In this video, we are going to discuss one of the important topic in the surveying, which is reciprocal leveling. And on this topic, many questions were asked in MBSC, WID, ZP, and uh, GATE exams. So at the end of the topic, we will discuss in what way the questions can be asked. So first, if you see reciprocal leveling, what is its purpose is, suppose there are two stations in the field, there are two stations in the field, this is station A suppose and this is station B. Now, if you want to conduct the simple leveling here, the problem is maybe the water is flowing, a stream is flowing between the two points like this. So you cannot set up the instrument in between the two points here. You cannot set up the instrument in between the two points here. So what I can do is I can conduct the reciprocal leveling in this case. And to conduct the reciprocal leveling, first we have to set up the instrument nearer to the station A. First we have to set up the instrument nearer to the station A and this instrument position I am calling as 1. And then I am taking the staff reading on station A and station B. I am taking the staff reading on station A and station B. So here on both these points I am taking the staff readings. On both the points I am taking the staff readings. Suppose this may be reading A1 and this may be reading B1. Okay, this may be reading A1, this may be reading B1. And then what I have to do is I have to shift the instrument to this position that is nearer to station B. I have to shift the instrument nearer to the station B. And at station B, uh, nearer station B, I am calling the instrument position as a 2. And whatever the readings I have taken now on station B that is called as B2 suppose and station A that is called as A2. Okay, so A2 means the staff reading taken on station A from the instrument position 2. A1 means staff reading taken on station A from the instrument position 1. So like this you have to take these 4 readings. And after taking these 4 readings you can determine the RL of the unknown point here. Suppose you know RL of one point you can determine RL of the other point. And what is the formula for that is RL of B minus RL of A equal to half into A1 minus B1 plus A2 minus B2. So using this formula you can determine what is the RL of B if RL of A is given or else you can determine what is the RL of A if RL of B is given. Okay, then in this talk, uh, if you conduct this reciprocal level, leveling, it will eliminate some of the errors. Okay, reciprocal leveling eliminates some of the errors. So what are those errors is, first one is error due to curvature of the earth and second one is error due to refraction and third one is error due to collimation that is collimation error so these three kinds of errors are eliminated in the reciprocal leveling okay and what is the magnitude of the error eliminated is so if you conduct this reciprocal leveling it will eliminate these three type of errors and what is the magnitude of error eliminated is magnitude of error eliminated equal to half into minus half into a1 minus b1 minus a2 minus b2 so just in this place in the place in the place of place you have to keep the minus here and we have to add the minus c here minus sign here then you will get what is the magnitude of the error eliminated now on this topic the questions can be asked like they will give RL of one point and they will give all these four readings here and they will ask you to determine what is the RL of another point. That is one type of question and they can ask the question like which of the following is not the type of the error eliminated in the reciprocal leveling. So there these three types of errors will be given another type of error will be given uh, maybe error due to incorrect graduation something like that. So that will be the answer and one more uh, one more question will be asked like what is the magnitude of the error, uh, error eliminated in reciprocal leveling by giving these four readings. So this kind of questions can be asked in MBSC, WID, JD, JP and GATE exams. Thank you.